Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to the Animal Crossing series. We made a boatload of money selling turnips. I think I bought for 106 each. I think that was the, the number. And then we sold for about 550, maybe 570. And the, the bank is about 2 million from the turnips. So money is not going to be a problem for a good while here. Let's see what Isabel has to say. Hello there, everyone. Right now in Cherisus is 4.37 p.m. on Friday, June 5th, 2020. Now for today's announcements. Today we have a visit staying at the campsite. I hope the entire island joins me in giving our guest a warm welcome. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Now it is wedding season and I haven't messed with it at all yet. Now I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm not too, too interested in wedding so uh you know we'll see what it's all about what's this doing down here pick that up uh, but let's go see who's at the campsite dude this guy looks so friggin uh cheesy <laughs> with his sunglasses on dude but like i kind of respect it just a tiny bit uh do we have a shovel with us no just money yeah that's the life all right let's use in the campsite today is it a duck looking for a duck show me the duck that's not a duck uh, I think my girl, yeah, my girlfriend has this villager. I think he's a grumpy boy. Uh, he had to do some camping for a spell. The shore is a nice island. You live here, right? If you have any recommendations for me while I'm here, let me know. Meow. I mean, I've already got a grumpy boy on the island, so, like, I'm not too bothered about uh, Mr. Grumps. What we're going to do is we're going to go bank all of this cash. Um, I just check in the sea here because I know sharks are here now and um, What would be amazing is if I just you know happen to run around the side of oh, Dina's over there. Hello, Dina How are you doing? Hey, stay away from hook Nice running into you. Woo woo. What's the latest Dina? Days like today are just made for watching trains uh, We don't have any trains on the island Dina um, <laughs> I don't know if it's possible to build a train set or anything, but, you know, now I'm tempted to because, like, if Dina wants it, Dina gets it. So, <gasps> was that a shark? I mean, last second, I feel like I saw a fin. And now I'm like, did I just blow it? And I feel like it did. That guy's a kind of a big fish right there, isn't it? Um, let's go and catch this bad boy. I know I'm getting, like... Slightly distracted here. My goal is to just put the money away, but I, I see this present coming in. I see the big fish It's probably a C plus, but maybe it's some kind of juicy honka. I don't know. It could be an all fish Nope, it's just a C plus. You know, what were we expecting? Um, oh Now I do have the sucker fish already. I managed to pick it up from another island now Is it a whale? Oh, what's this? Yes! I caught a saw shark. You could call it a sea saw. <laughs> Hilarious, dude. Um, all right. Uh, oh, no! I don't have my... Oh, that sucks, because if I go inside, it deletes the present, so we're going to have to lose a present because I'm not my slingshot with me. Um, that sucks. Okay, let's go send this to Blathers. One second. Ah! Okay, oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Daniel. Welcome to the Cherisus Museum. Uh, take my goddamn fish. Fish. There you go. Chuck her in a tank, mate. And don't you dare give me any information about this fish, because I'm a bit busy. Another time, yeah. All right, let's go bank the stuff and uh, grab some tools. Okay, banking 2.1 million, that puts us at 3.6 million, which is pretty good. Like, I don't spend a lot of money, to be honest. So, like, this is probably going to last me a while. And as long as we can keep getting on the turnip game every single week, the money's just going to go up and up and up. Oh, I got a yellow... I don't think I had this yellow flower before. That's cute. Oh, what's wrong with Sparkles? Whatever her name is. Sprinkle. <laughs> Sprinkle. Uh, I went that down. I started thinking of it really hard and I didn't notice you. I'm kind of thinking of moving away from this island. I mean, I got to see the world. I got to learn how to be famous. 
See, I, I don't know what to say. Like, on one hand, you know... We haven't really gotten along. Let's <laughs> let's be real. Uh, on the other hand, you know, it feels bad to lose a villager. And then on the other hand, you know, I should let her do what she wants to do. You know, I didn't speak to her enough. She's lonely on the island. And uh, uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe we can always replace her with a duck at the end of the day. So I don't mean that in a bad way. I mean, it's sprinkled you're going to be a great pop star one day where our personalities, they just don't match. So, you know, go make it big. And thank you for supporting me. No worries. It's totally sweet. When I'm famous, I'll get your front row. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I like you, Sprinkles, but about those front row tickets, well, it turns out I'm actually busy. Um, <laughs> When the show comes around, Sprinkles, like, I don't I mean to be busy at the time that the show comes around. It's just, you know, I, the music, it's, uh, you know, it's, uh, look, uh, you know, maybe I can come along if there's, uh, never mind. Okay, so as far as I know, I'm, I never really visited Harv, man. He's a, he's a strange fellow. Uh, I'm gonna go over there now, though, because as far as I know, all this wedding stuff is over at Harv's Island. Um... Don't really know what's gonna happen here. Down like building models in a snowmobile. We're parked and proud. Give a quack to Wingback. Carry cake static. Looks like we got a whole lot of radio chatter going on over yonder. Oh, look at this. We got two llamas trying to have over here. Hey, I hear you. We're still groovy. And the anniversary shoot's gonna happen. I'm just like behind a little. Well, okay, but uh, what do we do about the lovely sets? Prepping them ourselves could get a bit ticklish. Hey there, thanks for coming, so I need to borrow you for a minute. Okay, so this here is Reese and her main squeeze, Cyrus. They're married and in love them a whole bunch far out, right? Anyway, they want to get some anniversary photos made. Oh, look at those birds in the background. Fancy ones for sets and stuff. Because it's June now and June's wedding season. I hear they are. June is a whole season now. Wow. The thing is, I'm cool with landing out my studio, but my wedding sets are running slightly behind schedule. I'd order decorations and paint the walls and fly. But then a neat, long story long, someone's still gotta move stuff around so it's wedding ye. To snap some photos. So think I could ask you to be that someone? You'd really be helping this shutter dog out. Yeah, let's give it a go, man. I used to be, I used to do a lot of photography back in the day. So you hit me up with that Nikon, dude. I'll slap a 50 mil 1.4 on the end and we'll be ready to go. This is my wedding picture studio. It's actually my kitchen with some set walls I put up. Let me know if you get hungry. It works pretty much exactly like regular, not my kitchen studios. But if you forgot how those work, which will happen sometimes, just come find me outside. Uh, one thing, if you got to take five part way through, don't no problem, but talk to me before you go back in, okay? Otherwise, Reese is in charge. So if you want to know what to do, she's your alpaca. Did I say alpaca? Is that what I said before? I feel like I didn't call her an alpaca. I called her a llama. <laughs> hey, sorry, Reese. Totally thought you were a llama. Now I'm like thinking in my mind, what's the difference between an alpaca and a llama? And I need to look at some pictures. Hello there. It's so nice to meet you. I'm Reese. And I'm just pleased uh, as punch that you're helping us out. And this is my hubby, my darling. Oi, mate. My name's Cyrus. Good to meet you. I just know these photos are going to be so romantic and just in time for our anniversary. Of course, we do this every year for anniversary, but it's always special, isn't it? It's just like a slice of life from that year. A delicious slice. Almost as sweet as our love, right, Han? That's right. Sweeter than the sweetest shortbread. Oh, you. Such a romantic. Oh! Sorry, I forgot what we were doing for a second there. We just get so lost in our own little world sometimes. Anywho. So here's what we're thinking for this year's photo sets. A recreation of our entire wedding day. Oh, bloody hell. And you can help us by making this place feel like we're saying I do all over again. It'll be just like decorating your own place. Easy peasy. Oh, I almost forgot. My amazing Psy guy even built some custom wedding furniture for the shoot. Isn't that so sweet of my schmoopy? 
He really put his heart into them, so I hope you can make them work. Just open up the event tab and take a look. Oh, yeah. So today, I'm thinking we should uh, take a ceremony photo in a place that looks like a wedding chapel. It'll be just like a real ceremony, professing our love for each other in front of everyone. So romantic. What we're looking for is a cute set with plenty of pink and white. Preferably using lots of the furniture my side guy made. This is when you're ready for us to start posing, I can't see wait what you come up with. All right, so what do I do? Oh, we press these buttons. Let's have a look here. Uh, storage. Oh, here we go. So we get one of these? Is that how this works? Or did you get multiples? Oh, you get multiples, okay. So, I mean, it seems pretty simple. Um, oh, we got infinite stuff. Well, I just don't know where to start. Um, What do alpacas eat? Oh, one of these. Cherry blossom. Oh, pink and white. Oh, yeah, we got to do pink and white. These are pink. Uh, We'll shove one in, like, every corner. You know what? Even better, dude. Even better. Each side of each uh, chair thing, we'll do one of these. So we're going to need one, two, three, four more, dude. Wait, are you telling me this is not on point? Because it looks pink and white to me. Oh, yes, a desktop computer. Just what you want at your wedding. So you can play some League of Legends at the back right there. As you just get into things. Um... That's kind of cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with that, though. Uh, ooh, cupcakes. Pots. Uh, candles. We'll stick some candles on the wall, mate. Uh, maybe some flowers. Do we have any flowers or anything that are the, like the right color? Oh, here we go. Corkboard, dude. Look at this. How do I do this? So these are like... Oh, look at this. These are the good times in our life on the wall. Um, okay, what else can we do? Wallpaper. Nope, no wallpaper. Let's have a look down here. Flooring is no good. Any rugs, mate? No rugs, mate. Can I dress them up? I don't think I can. Um, no, they're not into that. Ooh, bear umbrella. Oh, put some of these down. These are just the right color, dude. Oh, these may be better than the plants. Other colorful nets. I mean, they don't really want tools at their wedding, do they? Oh, we could have a dinosaur wedding, dude. That would be dang. Can you imagine going to a wedding and they've got a freaking big ass T Rex fossil there? Like, then you'd be interested, dude. What's this? Residence. Oh, we can't bring him in. I just put some skulls in the corner. Uh, I don't know. Like, I kind of want to go. Oh, this is cute. Oh, dude, KK Bubblegum. These totally seem like some KK Bubblegum listeners. Um, Okay, I think that's about it. Oh, we get some of these wedding decorations on the wall. Slap some of those around. Oh, they're big. Check these out. Um... Okay, so now let's move some of the stuff around. I reckon one of these there. Oh, it fits perfectly. Yeah, that looks pretty okay. Um, maybe we'll delete this one. How do I delete it? Store it. Okay. And then, you know, on the sides here. Oh, I need to grab it first. On the sides here, you got the memories. So the people who are in the crowd who are getting bored, they're like, hey. So you just put it here when you come in. They can, they can look at it. Because the windows are kind of in the way. That's just going to have to be there. Actually, with two sets of uh, memories. Yeah, these are for the... These are for, like, the grandparents who came along, but they don't really know who they're watching. So they can just look back there and be like, Oh, yeah, 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 that time, uh, yeah. And then they can pretend that they, uh, they know what's going on. All right, back to the floor. Um... Let's spin some of these around. And again, they're a bit big, aren't they? I might trip over them. I can't even put it next to that. Oh, this is a disaster, dude. Why does one plan need so much space? It's ridiculous. Okay, let's turn this around. 
Again, I, I what, why did I put a desktop PC there? No, 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 no. I was joking. I don't actually want that though. Then I actually gonna play League of Legends. Okay, chuck that over there. I wonder how the, the scoring system works here because like I'm getting a little bit worried that I don't have enough stuff. Like maybe I need something at the back. We definitely got a few too many friggin' secure trees. Um, oh, we can put these at the back. Look at that, that's cute. Actually, you know what? Even better, over here. We'll have it right next to them. It's gonna look freaking adorable, dude. Um, KK Bubblegum. The Blue Llama is just like the biggest fan of Mr. Bubblegum. Sorry, Mr. KK and his hit single Bubblegum. How do I switch to the wall? I don't know how to put this on the wall. I think I gotta take it down. All right, screw you, KK Slider. You, you get, you're out of here. Um, we're gonna have to put some of these back in storage. Yep, out of here. Still feel like there needs to be something at the back. Let me, well, first of all, these are not aligned and that's not acceptable. That looks pretty good though. Uh, oh, we're missing one goddamn little bonsai tree. What have I done? I removed the carpet. I'm pressing the wrong buttons, help. Okay, we got the carpet back. Hang on. How do I put it the right way? There you go. Something looks off. Like maybe there needs to be something in the corners. I don't know why I'm getting into this. I'm just, you know, I'm, I, 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 I don't really care about weddings, but obviously like I'm trying to do something here. So next page, I think we had the little tree. I think it was up here. So, oh no, dude, it's gonna be so hard to find the tree. Little bonsai boy. Ooh, yeah, get those in the corners. Okay, as for the tree, oh, it's gonna be in here somewhere. There we go. Okay, let's uh, sort this out real quick. So chuck these over there. I don't know why we need two of these. It just feels like the alignment is correct, you know, by doing it like that. And then we need something over here, snacks. That's what we need, like snacks at the back. You know, you get bored of the wedding. You step out to the back, right? Ooh, baby, give me a cake. Um, so we're gonna need like a little table. Let's have a look for a table. Not many options here, boys. I don't really want to put a full kitchen set <laughs> in the wedding room, so... Uh, no. Serving cart. Yeah, two of these at the back here. Four of them, dude. This is a hungry, hungry crowd. Feed us. Feed us now. There we go. That's better. Now it doesn't look uneven. And all we gotta do is chuck some cakes on. And uh, I'm pretty satisfied with the whole ordeal here. Uh, where do I get a cake? Fashion, rugs, floors, wallpaper, wall mounted. It's gotta be in here. Somewhere. A uh, little tea set, man. Little tea set. The color's not really right. I don't know about the tea set. Uh, dinnerware. Uh, struggling to find what's right here. I mean, cupcakes. It's a birthday cup. Dude, no one's gonna know that it's Rami's birthday. He just needs to get them eaten up, okay? Chuck it on top of the serving car. Actually, it looks really good. I wonder if we can find another bit of food. What have we got? Eggs? Nobody wants eggs. Uh, do the dishes, dinnerware. I mean, we could chuck some dinnerware in, but like for a cupcake, is it worth it? Houseware. I mean, maybe there's some food in here. There's gotta be something to eat, man. Where's all the food in this game? Creatures. Oh, nice snack today, guys. We got you, um... Uh, sunfish. Yes. 
Yeah, of course. Sunfish in a microwave? Oh my god, no, no. That's not, no, that's not gonna work, actually. I was hoping it would just be a little bit smaller than that. Well, I think we're gonna just have to accept that the only thing we've got are birthday cupcakes. Um, you know, because we don't really have anything else. So it's cupcakes only, guys. We don't even have drinks. Like I can't even put some alcohol. Okay, I'm going. I'm going with the. Uh, I'm going with this. I just realized that the little paintbrush that is shown. <gasps> Cake. There we go. Okay, never mind. Please fit. Yes, look at that. Now we're talking. Now people are going to be wanting to come to this wedding. All right, finish it up. Let's get some pictures taken. Hello. Oh, it's coming along. Does this mean you're ready for us to start the photo session? Let's get it done. Yay, this is so exciting. Um, but before we get started, I do have another Teamsy request. Uh, will you be our photographer? Yes. Don't get me wrong, Harvey's great. It's just this lovely set is your vision. I want you to realize it. So when you're ready, just press ZL to launch the camera app and then press plus to take a picture. If you find yourself in the frame and you don't want to be, press minus to change what's shown in frame. Asking a lot, but I also know you got this. I can't wait to see what you come up with. All right, let's get a nice angle here, dude. Wait, 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 whoa, 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 no, 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 that's not what I wanted to do. Um, oh, okay. Ah. Boom, I vanish. So you want a nice artistic angle. Blue Llama looks a bit grumpy, doesn't he? Uh, we got a little bit of a zoom in, dude. Oh, you want to get the cake? But I need the full face of the girl Llama. This is not going to be easy. Oh, you know what we need? A bit up. Yeah. But no, 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 not that much. Like this. Oh, look at that. The only problem is her eyeball is kind of covered up by that little rose. Is it a rose? I think it's a rose. Mm. It's not coming together how I wanted it to. Maybe we got to forget about the cake. Let me get a bit of a zoom out here, actually. Okay, we just go for the cupcake. That's the new goal here. Cupcake at the front. Or maybe forget the cake entirely. Oh, that's the angle. Almost. It's just the goddamn chair is just in the way. Like, come on, buddy. Okay, we're going for a wide angle. No, ah, this is harder than it looks. Tempted to remove the bench. Like, you need some foreground element. I think this is the best I'm gonna get. Like, we're just gonna have to say... Oh, wait a second. Oh, that's the shot right there. Look at that. Okay, we're gonna frame it. What kind of filter? Soft, it's a bit too much. Dramatic, it's a bit too much. Film, that's what you'd like to see. Let's hit him with the frame here. Oh, yeah. I just want to go up the tiniest amount, but I still want the cake. Boom, that's the shot. Let's take it. Yes. Beautiful. All right. Hey. Last one seemed nice. Take a quick peek. Did you take more than one? Just take a look at the last one. Yeah, go ahead. Have a look. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. Is everything I could have wanted? You somehow captured all the joy and love that my darling and I share in one amazing photo. I love it. Anyway, I have a little something to show our appreciation. I hope you like it. My side guy uh, made it just for you. It's a wedding bench. He seems a bit grumpy. And because I'm just full of surprise, I have some heart crystals for you. They're so cute that I just hate to give them away, but my side guy likes them too. He'll trade you for furniture. So I guess you can do this every day. Get yourself some crystals and trade them in, dude. 
Thank you so much for everything. You helped us make a wonderful new memory. You know this was so fun. Would you be interested in helping us out again tomorrow? We have the studio space ready for the entire month. Just think of all the different themes we could try. Well, no pressure, darling, but I do hope you'll consider it. Thanks again. Okay, yeah, you got something for me there, buddy? Howdy, squirt! <laughs> squirt? What do you mean, squirt? Any interest in trading those heart crystals? Okay, how many have I got? What's grabbing you? I got nine. I wonder if you get, like, different points. I mean, I kind of like these. Everything else, I'm not really that interested, to be honest. Deal's a deal. I wonder if you can actually get this from the catalog um, after you've done it. Anyway, let's get out of here, dude. Um, that was cute. I don't know if I'll be doing that again. Oh, half. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh, I'm out of here, buddy. Foxtrot Wilbur. Attention, fledgling. The squawk has got a transmission for you. Dodo has a dabbling in item delivery and liquidation. Services start here. Now for you, copy. See, you can flap all you want, but an overburden bird will never get you off the ground, copy. Uh, you grokking while I'm squawking? Sometimes you gotta do more than flex your wings. You gotta ditch some cargo to fly free, copy, copy. Uh, so feel free to offload some of your goods with us. We can send them to your home base or buy them outright. Let me just make sure I've got my beak on straight so I can plot out the flight plan, plan for you first. Let's talk delivery. We'll ship your goods safe and sound straight to your home storage. And we won't bombard you with pesky handling fees. So fly high and buck as often as you want. As for liquidation, well, let me just confirm that dodos are collectors. Maybe your intel on that was lacking. But it's true. And this service is for those who want to unload some of their excess baggage for extra bells with nuts cranny, our partners on the ground. We'll buy your packages for what you... Oh, my God. You talk so much, Wilbur. Let's, uh, let's get it on the road, buddy. Get me out of here. Train wreck blueberry pies report in tango archery is go. I'm ready to go. You want to bust Bunsen burners and bounce back to Cherry Town? Yes. Let's pack snacks and make tracks. <laughs> I love this guy, man. Okay, so there's another thing that I need to do. And uh, this is something I asked on the last episode. And I was like, um, so I got this two space building and I don't really like it. I don't know what you guys think? And you know, someone wrote a really nice comment and uh, I don't have the name ready, but thank you so much for that comment. And it was basically, you know, Animal Crossing is about making your perfect island. And like, if I don't think this is perfect, then I shouldn't go with it. And in my opinion, I do need the three wide to be satisfied. So unfortunately, well, I've been trying to put these houses here for so long. We're going to have to start again. So I'm going to move this guy over here. And then I'm going to move this guy over here. And then I'm going to move this guy over there. And then we're going to put them all back in the same spots. It's going to be a big old disaster. In fact, if I calculate this correctly, um, we should be able to put this one in the right spot to the right and then move this one into this spot. And that's going to save us a lot of time. Ah, that's a big brain. So let me do the calculations here. So three, which means the start of this building would be one more this way. So the building would start here. Let me mark this so it's a lot easier. Um, Island designer. Start construction. Now, I'm always scared of messing this up, but I haven't yet. So I got me hats on. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, this is where the new building would begin. No, no. This is where the new building would begin. No, this is where the new building would begin if there was one more space here. So, all we have to do is move this building to this spot. No, that's not right. That's where the new pathway would begin. So this would be a three-wide pathway right here, and then the building would be right here. Is it gonna fit? It's gonna be right on the edge of the beach. 
please, for the love of God, fits. Does it automatically destroy trees or not? You know, we can just move them anyway. I'm very scared that this house is not going to fit and then my plans are completely ruined again. And I'm not going to know what to do in that scenario. So please, please, just fit. I, I feel like it's not going to fit. Is it one, two? It might fit. It might just fit. It's, it's going to be real tight. But I think we might be in business here. Yes, I do have the uh, the present flying in the side. Don't worry, I got it. But first, let's whip up these trees. I guess we only got to get this one. And uh, we can grab this guy. We'll move this guy anyway. Like, eventually he's going to have to go. So get out of here. Peace, buddy. And we'll grab this present real quick. Um, there we go. Here we go. Boom. What do we got today? Let's have a look. Open her up. We have ourselves uh, some water flooring. Interesting. I just want to check this out. What do we got here? DIY recipes. Oh, that's crazy. Summer shells. I haven't seen a summer shell yet. Interesting. Okay, so this is where it begins. Let's go see if we can do it. And I guess we move this one to the right, that one can go down there, and then that one can go there. Easy jigsaw puzzle. Hopefully I'm not messing anything up here. Uh, Sheldon, we're gonna be moving your house for the fifth time, buddy. Uh, I apologize. Oh, I think it just fits. Please let me do this. Yes! Oh man, that's a relief. Now let's hope I get everything correct. So he moves to there. We'll move this house here to the new spot here. And then we should have a three wide to move this guy over to there. I know you can't see where my hand's pointing, but like, hopefully you understand what I'm saying here. I think we're in business. I think we're in business. Nice. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'll be back in the next one. Um... Yeah, that's about it. Um, let me know if you enjoyed it by clicking the like button. It really helps me out, guys. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow for another episode. Thank you for watching. Peace, guys.